In today's video, I'm going to be ranking seven video creation apps. These are apps that you would use to create marketing videos or video ads for your business. Or you could create a video and sell it to somebody else. Now, a couple points. First of all, these are all online apps. I did not look at all at software programs like Filmora or Movavi or Cyberlink. So just online programs. The other thing is that there are obviously more than seven online video creation apps that you can use to create marketing videos for your business. I chose these seven because in my opinion, they are either really good or they seem to be very well known. And for each one of these, I have a full review and demo on my YouTube channel. So if you want to know more about any of these, you can just search for the individual review on my YouTube channel. So what are the seven apps? Animoto, Biteable, FlexClip, InVideo, Ofeo, Vimeo Create, and finally Wave Video. So those are the seven apps I'll be ranking in this video. Now, what are the criteria that I'm using to rank these? There's basically two. One is user interface, which gets into the idea of how easy is it to use that particular app. And the other are the features, and particularly the features for creating video ads or marketing videos. I am not considering features that do not relate to video ads or marketing videos. So for example, some of these programs provide video hosting. That's not a focus of what I'm looking at here, so that's not included at all in the ranking criteria. And I also didn't include price because, again, because some of these have video hosting, that can greatly increase the pricing. And I also think that ultimately, if an app is good enough, you should be willing to pay a, a premium price for it if need be. Although I think in this case, the ones that I have as the top are actually perhaps less expensive than some of the ones I have at the bottom. But these are the criteria that I personally felt were the most important in terms of ranking these video creation apps. The other thing to note is that I've divided these into three tiers. I just felt like it really wasn't worth trying to decide which is number six, which is number seven. I mean, if you're at the bottom, it's generally not a good program. So I decided to divide these into three tiers. So we have the bottom tier, which are the programs I simply do not recommend at all. Then we have the mid tier, which I think are good programs. They're definitely worth looking at. They didn't quite make my top tier, but it doesn't mean they're a bad program at all. And then obviously we have the top tier, which are my recommended video creation app programs. So in the bottom tier, I have the following three programs. Animoto, Biteable, and the Mayo Create. Now, what I'll say about these programs is in general, they have a very nice, clean, easy to use user interface. The problem with them is a simple lack of features. And of course, there's often a trade-off, right? If you don't have many features, then it's very easy to create an easy user interface. But I think what you'll find with these programs is it's just they're very limited in terms of the types of videos that you can create with them, and they don't give you a lot of flexibility in terms of design. So for me, these are the three that I feel are just simply not worth looking at. Now in the mid-tier, I have the following two programs. In video and wave video. Now again, being in the mid-tier, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. If you like these programs, if you use these programs, I like them too. I think they have good features. I think they're relatively easy to use. They just don't, for me, quite make it into that top tier because I think the two that I'm going to show you simply have better features and or a much better user interface. And so again, very good programs, just not for me at the top level. So if you've been following along, you already know which programs are still left. So you know which two are in my top tier, but they're in my top tier for two different reasons. So I think it's still worth continuing to watch what I have to say here. And by the way, if you wanna learn more about these two programs, I will have links to them down in the video description. So top tier best features. So which of these programs I looked at, in my opinion, has the best features? That is, Ofeo. And again, I have a full review and demo of Ofeo on my, on my YouTube channel, which I encourage you to look at, but I will at the end here give you a brief overview of some of the features of, of Ofeo so you can see what I'm talking about. But for me, this is a program that has by far the best feature set for creating marketing videos or video ads. And then finally, top tier best user interface. There's obviously only one app left and that is FlexClip. I really love FlexClip. It's very easy to use, very fun to use in terms of making a marketing video or a video ad. And it also has really nice features. So it's better than those ones in the bottom tier because it 
both has a better interface and has many more features. So I wanna give you just a real quick look at Ofeo and FlexClip, but again, for both of these, I have longer reviews and demos on my YouTube channel. So here is Ofeo, and you see that they give you three different ways to start creating a marketing video or a video ad. Most programs give you this here, designer templates. So they have lots of different curated designs, and you can start with one of those designs and then create a video. Or you can use an empty canvas. This is something that, as far as I've seen, every single program has as well. But Ofeo also gives you these two other really interesting options. One is Smart Create, where you start with an image and you can remove the background within Ofeo and then it will design videos around your image. So it's a great option if you sell products because you can very easily create a video, a video ad for your products. And this here, you enter into Ofeo things like your font choices, your color choices, different shape co choices, and then it creates templates just for your brand. So again, a very unique feature for Ofeo. And then even when it comes to editing a video or creating a video within Ofeo, you just have a lot more design options. So let's just look at something simple like text. So I click there on that text. You see here, you know, you get standard things, the color, the font, the size, etc. But then you come here at effects. Now you see here, you have the text background. Now that's pretty common, you know, to have a background on the text and you can change the color. But with Ofe, you can do, you know, you can change the width, you can change the height, you can make it round, you can make it transparent, you can give it a drop shadow, blur, reflection, ground shadow, etc. I haven't seen those features in other programs. So again, Yes, this text background other programs have, but they don't have all these other features that Ofeo has. And then when it comes to adding different elements into your video, again, Ofeo just has so much more to offer than similar programs. So if I come over here to graphics, I have all these awesome graphics that I can add. And you know, you see here shapes are 27 different shapes, 38 different hand illustrations, 212 abstract shapes, 52 back to school, turn 65 stickers, etc. So they have a lot of really cool elements that you can add into your videos. I mean, look at all these things. You come over here to overlays. And again, you're getting cool things, emojis, ground, cl ground collapse, flying leaves overlay, cloth reveal, confetti overlay, sports ball transition, rain overlay, etc. Again, some really, really cool effects that you have access to in Ofeo that I just have not seen in other programs. And then coming over here to effects. Again, you get smoke effects, fire overlay, sparks, explosion fire, fireworks, etc. So you can do a lot with Ofeo. It's a very powerful program. And of course, as I showed you, once you add something into Ofeo, then you have a ton of options in terms of uh, tweaking it and making it look, it look the way you want it to look. Uh, coming over here to stocks, they have recently integrated with Shutterstock, so you get access to Shutterstock, both photos, videos, and music as part of Ofeo. So you don't have to pay any extra for that at all. And you know, if you're familiar with Shutterstock at all, it's a great company. They have a lot of great uh, design assets for creating videos and other, other things. Um, so again, you've got videos here from Shutter, Shutterstock. You also have masks here, so you can put photos or videos within one of these masks. You have letter ones, you could actually spell it out word and, and then you know put a photo or video within the spelled out word. Here you've got backgrounds. So again, look at this, 181 shapes, 193 illustrations, 61 grunge, 60 grain, etc. Patterns. All these really cool patterns that you can put in here and then again, you can edit them, change colors, change uh, you know different uh, things within these uh, within these different patterns, and then background video. So uh, as you're seeing, there's just a lot of different things you can do with an Ofeo. It's just there's just so many more features here than in other programs I've looked at. And then there's music right there. Again, music from Shutterstock. So. Again, I will put a link to Ofeo down in the video description below. This is definitely one of my top programs. Again, I have it along with Ofeo in my top tier. And I think this is one that if you're looking for a program to create video ads or marketing videos, either for yourself or for other people, this is one you should absolutely, absolutely, absolutely look at. 
So let's take a quick look at FlexClip. And as I've said before, I have a much longer review and demo of FlexClip on my YouTube channel if you want to take a look at that. And by the way, I just said that I absolutely, absolutely, absolutely love Ofeo. Well, I feel the same way about FlexClip. I absolutely, absolutely, absolutely love it. But again, for different reasons. For Ofeo, it's for the features. For FlexClip, it's for the ease of use. So if you are thinking which one of these is better for your particular situation, it really depends if you prefer to have a lot of features or if you prefer a video creation app that is easy to use while still being powerful. So that is how I would differentiate between those two, these two programs and which one you should choose. But you really can't go wrong with either one of them. They're both really amazing programs. So here you see with FlexClip, you have create by templates or start from scratch. As I said, every single program has that, but there is one unique thing with FlexClip. If I click here, you see, first of all, I have storyboard mode, which would be similar to creating with a template just starting from scratch, or you have this timeline mode. Now this is in beta, but it's going to be similar to what you would get with a Movavi or a Filmora or a CyberLink PowerDirector. So you have this timeline down here, and then you add different elements into the timeline, photos, videos, text, uh, etc. And it gives you actually, you know, I played around with it. it is still in beta, but it gives you a lot more control over how you create your video. So I think this could very well be a game changer. Again, it's still in beta, but it is a very unique and interesting feature that you will find within FlexClip. So for this overview, let's take a look at the design by template method. So I chose this template here and you see, first of all, you have this very big workspace that you can use. You have this timeline down here that is very easy to use. You know, you can just very easily move things from one place to another. You can click there to change or add transitions. Uh, you can hover over here to play that clip, to duplicate it, up there to delete it. Uh, again, this is what I love about FlexClip. It's so easy to use. Another thing, this is a feature I love about FlexClip. So I have this font here, Poppins. Let's say I want to change that font. I click there, I pick a new font, and now I can apply it to all storyboards. So I don't have to go through each individual scene and change the font. I can do it once and then apply it to all storyboards. And you'll see that throughout FlexClip, this option to make a change and then apply it to all storyboards. It's a, it, you know, it really speeds up the process of creating a video. And again, this is why, in my opinion, FlexClip is the best program in terms of user interface. But as I mentioned, FlexClip also has some really awesome features. So if I look here at text, you see I have some basic text, but then I also have a lot of dynamic text. So moving text here, some pretty cool features there that you can add into your videos. And there are a lot of options there. Overlays. So again, you're not seeing all here. I'd have to click on see all this to show you all of them, but they have these overlays for text overlays for decoration. You can change the color schemes on these. You know, you don't, you're not stuck with that, those particular colors if you're not a fan of pink and uh, I guess it's kind of a blue there. Uh, and then they have these logo intros and outro. So again, some really neat and interesting features and things that I ne haven't necessarily seen in other programs. And I have some elements here. So, you know, some really cool things for social media. And again, elements that move, they're dynamic, they're not static. And again, shapes, arrows, birthday promo, etc. So some nice stickers. But again, what I really like, what sticks out to me are these uh, social media icons up here that are dynamic, you know, really eye catching. And then a couple other things to show you real quick right here, you can record your voice. And up here, you can record your screen or record your webcam. Record your voice, I've seen in other programs, but record your screen or webcam, I think is fairly unique to FlexClip. And then also you have your stock media. So if I click there, I have stock video and stock photo, and these come from Storyblocks, which is another really great company for, uh, for videos and photos, and then also music. So you have Storyblock music right here. So again, some really great digital assets that you have as part of FlexClip that you can add to your video. So there you go. My set, the seven video creation apps ranked. FlexClip and Ofeo, in my opinion, the two best. You cannot go wrong with either one of these programs. There will be links to both of them down in the video description below. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and I hope to see you next time. Bye.